Hey guys, I uh, hope you guys are enjoying the new update. Um, I'm going to demonstrate one of the new features, or one of the new redesigned features of the update, guides. Uh, let's jump over here into Infinite Design. Um, the car that you saw a second ago actually started in Infinite Design uh, to get the nice crisp outline and to uh, to have the freedom to work and then you notice that I had it in painter and I was doing a lot of the coloring in there to get the colors and the realistic uh, realistic paint look that I wanted. So I'm going to go ahead and set up the project uh, right now. Let's go ahead and set it up so that we can get going. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how you can use guides in order to uh, to get really nice crisp outlines and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the elliptical guide in order to uh, to trace over this rim on the car and so I'm going to bring the uh, the lips over here and uh, to move it around you'll notice that the elliptical guide has uh, four different controls obvious controls on it you can see the uh, the top right control is the scale control it allows you to scale the ellipse um, then the uh, the left side is the move control. The right side is rotate, and the bottom is to delete the guide. In order to hide the controls, you just press the center of the ellipse, and the controls will disappear and be out of your way. And this is really convenient if you're doing small ellipses, so that you don't accidentally press the buttons of the controls. So you can notice how it creates nice, smooth, crisp. Um, lines as it hugs to the curve of the ellipse and you can really take advantage of this for all sorts of different things right now I'm using it um, actually to create a rim but you can actually use it for uh, eyes or other things even partial curves and so I'm just going to continue here for a moment just trying to uh, take advantage of this guide to, uh, to get a lot of these crisp curves and then uh, after we, uh, we get a few of these things set up. I will then demonstrate the linear guide, uh, which does which deals with straight lines. So let me go ahead and finish up here. Just getting some more of the, the detail of the rim. Just a little bit more. As you can see, it's it's quite easy to uh, to really take advantage of this tool, and it makes drawing a lot easier. It's almost templated uh, for anyone to use. So, okay, we're almost done. Um, Okay, we're going to bring in the linear guide now. You'll notice that it has three different controls and the uh, the button to let you hide the controls has move, rotate, and to remove the guide, the delete button. And, uh, so I'm going to go ahead and make a few different straight lines here. Let me go ahead and uh, I'm going to go ahead and pivot the guide um, at the center of the rim. Um, all right, that might be a little bit better. Yeah. So as you can see, uh, these guides can be uh, can be really convenient in letting you uh, create nice, crisp, purposeful strokes. Um, with, uh, with a really easy tool to use. So definitely take advantage of these. All right.